morning, sir. Good morning, Sandra. How are you? Very well, thank you, sir. Good, good. Um, the chairman has requested to see you as soon as you come in. Is everything okay? I presume so. You know, with that crafty old man, one should always be on his toes. <laughs> yes, and um, have I told you you look beautiful today? Yes, sir. You remind me how beautiful I am every morning. How do I? Uh, maybe it's my memory. I, I keep forgetting. No, but you never forget to tell me how beautiful I am, sir. Except on Saturdays and Sundays because you run away every weekend. <laughs> Don't worry. One of these weekends, I'll surprise you. Yeah, and um, please, could you, you know, kindly drop this sir uh, thing? Call me Lucky, okay? And, um, speaking of Lucky, um, can this weekend be my lucky weekend? I'll think about this, sir. <laughs> drop this sir, uh, okay? Drop this sir, uh, don't forget that. Alright? Yes. Okay. Well, I'm very sure you've met uh, one of your directors, Ms. Uh, Anne William, my lovely daughter. Oh, nice to meet you, Miss Williams. It's nice to meet you. My father has spoken very highly of you. Really? Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> your father, the chairman, hardly compliments anyone. Well, you're quite right, except for those who uh, deserve it. Now, this young man here, Lucky, is one of the most diligent young men I ever met. And I love him like a son. Thank I you. I love him like a son. Thank you very much, sir. Perhaps uh, you both might want to get acquainted later. Um, uh, absolutely, Daddy. Absolutely. Uh, does Mr. Lucky have a problem with that? <laughs> no, not at all. Not at all. Very good. Very good. I must say, it's really surprising. Uh, <laughs> I've worked with your father now for, what, four years? And I never met you? Well... Not that is because after my education in Canada, I chose to stay back to pick up, you know, experience in some things. And here I am on the second phase of my journey, became tutorials for my father's most trusted staff. <laughs> really? Wow. <laughs> That's a great compliment. I mean, speaking of obligations, I do feel obliged, you know, learning from your vast experience. <laughs> Thank you. You know, we are going to get along so smoothly. My father talks about you so much. Good things, I must say. At a point, I got so aggravated. You know, upset and jealous, I must say. Really? <laughs> yes. I was hoping to dislike you at first sight and look for faults to discredit you. <laughs> well, I'm happy I've been able to impress you. Yes, you did. Um, I, I certainly would love to get to know you better. So I'm wondering, what are you doing this weekend? Well, uh, I'm an indoor person. I pretty much like to while away my time at home, you know, watching movies, listening to music, reading books. You just cock. Excuse me? <laughs> I don't my friend, I'm sorry. I meant to say, I do not think you're an interesting person anymore. Well, let's just say I live a pretty dull life. You don't have any friends? Yeah, I have a friend. Um, and my friend lives with me. A leave in lover? <laughs> I'm not gay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I was actually assuming it was a woman. <laughs> you caught me there. Really. <laughs> oh, my God. oh my God. So, um, Canada, Nigeria, your yeah. preference? Well, it's awesome. Um, the change is tremendous. I mean, the difference is so clear when it comes to the weather. Infrastructures, <laughs> you know, it's just so wow. But Nigerians will call it is my home. <laughs> so, I don't have time to No, but I am happy for you. At least you know where your relationship is let me have three hundred naira worth of everything. It's rather amazing that Idewo doesn't appreciate you. Honestly, if I were in your shoe, I would have long moved on. I wouldn't be patient like you. I'm just good in time. I really am. Plenty of time. 
saying before, if you asked me, the relationship was over a long time ago. Six months to be precise. So what are you going to cook all this? In this house as usual? <laughs> no, not this time. I have something else up my sleeve. Sandra, have you stayed hiding things from me? Oh, no, now. You know you're, my st you're still my best friend. But this time, I'm going to keep quiet. Let me make sure I know what I'm doing first. Thank you. <laughs> oh, let's go now. So, um, Thank you. So who's the date? Ah, don't worry, you'll meet her soon. Wow, I'm very happy for you at least. Finally, you are dating someone because I was worried about you. Yeah, you think I'm you who sleeps with everything in Come on, man, life is fun. Just enjoy yourself while you can. Thank you. Thank you very much. You. <laughs> so where are you taking her? Taking her. She's coming here. Um, she, she's going to come here with Jace, with chat. She'll cook. And um, maybe she'll allow me to kiss her. <laughs> and what's funny? <laughs> oh, oh God! Oh. <laughs> what's funny? Listen, she's coming here, yes. and you guys are gonna jeez and chat, and maybe she's gonna cook. Yes. And you dress like this. What's wrong with my dress? Oh. Look, I've told you over and over again. Learn from the master. I don't know why they don't find you attractive. What are you talking about? Listen, man. Go and change this jacket. Change the slings. I mean, wear something short. Look sexy for the lady. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll only take off the jacket. That, 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 that's all I'm going to do. Go and change it to something sexy. Just see me. Hey, so uh, how do I look, man? You look good, you look good. Hey, 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 hey. Where, where, where are you going? I guess it's your date. What? You're, you're going to open the gates dressed like this with this your dirty singlet, your dirty shorts, and your useless legs. Something wrong with you. If I will you go inside? I just want to. I said, go inside and dress well. What's, what's your problem? I'm sorry, Lucky. Alright, uh, uh, yeah. It's a beautiful place. Ah, thank you, thank you, <laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. Do you live here alone? Um, no, I actually do live here with. Um... Hi! Well, pretty lady, my name is Kalechi, then you? Sandra, wow, what a lovely name for a beautiful lady. Mm, 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 mm. Don't tell me the fragrance you're wearing is um. It's Shadow by Dior. I knew it! <laughs> I just knew it! Wow. Well, <laughs> well, I'm <clears throat> I'm yet to see a woman who really doesn't admire me. <laughs> um, 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 you're about going out, right? Oh no, no, I'm not. You, you, you mean you're staying indoors wearing? This cheap jacket and this cheap shoes. I thought I bought hey, you better ones for come, Christmas. Come on, man. What is that? You know, I have to put myself together. I know. Try it! 
Tapi lo happy Hey What? You know, I'm admiring everything you do Is that all you can say? <laughs> um, hey, well, he's in love I know what you want to say Sandra, I've been waiting patiently for you to finish. However, when you walked in, I got, got crushed. <laughs> From the look of your body and on the fragrance that was coming up of this shapely, lovely <laughs> body. And I said to myself, oh my god, she got class. And then the, the armband of your food. <laughs> wow, something else. Come on, bro. Have you tested the food? No, I haven't. Because the food is not ready yet. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Well, when I was a kid, I used to hang around with my mom in the kitchen. She always used to say, come over here and have a taste. May I have an honor? No, would you mind me giving you that honor with a knife? Hey, hey. Oh. If he didn't ask, would you have asked? But, you know, I've been admiring everything you do. Yes, you have, but to be honest, um, I'm starting to find you a bit uncomfortable. And I kind of wished you weren't here. Why? You never compliment me. Uh, but um, the, f the food is not ready yet. I always told you to learn to treat a lady right. Would you like to taste the meat? Of course, it's hard. I would love to. Yes. Good. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm. Mmm. This is awesome. <laughs> I thought my mama was the best. But where did you find her? Well, somewhere I didn't find you. And I, I kind of think this place is getting overcrowded. Hey, so you need to go. Yes, you just need to go like right now. Bye. Oh, I'll never see you again. Go. Don't tell me you were jealous. Um, food smells good. Very good. You, you look nice too. Cook it. Very nice. <gasps> ah! Good. Hey, hey, what was that for? Come on, I was just helping you to fly along. What do you mean by that? I, just, I never saw it that way, you know? No, 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 you have to really stop. I hope that's one of your girls because trust me, I'm going to be very, very uncomfortable. Trust me. You're welcome. <laughs> My name is Kalichi, but for a beautiful lady like you, call me Kaya. Hi, my name is and Oh, that really doesn't matter. Okay, I call you Angel. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, oh man, this is exceptional. <laughs> wow, you didn't tell me your friend was this charming. Well, that's why we call him Clown. Very funny though. <laughs> well, since Lucky here doesn't want to do the right thing, I'll do it. Come on, lady. Oh, mm -hmm, mm. your skin, your, your skin is so smooth, and you smell like a baby. Wow! <laughs> you see, lucky what I told you. Yeah, you're very lucky. So why don't you welcome your guests for me? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Please follow me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My goodness, you guys are just so charming. Oh, Ooh. good. Food is ready. Yes, mine you mean? <laughs> Hello. Hi. Um, good afternoon, Miss Anna. Hmm. Well, I hope you do not intend to eat that because I brought you food. 
<laughs> I did. Where's the kitchen? Um, yes, actually, this is place. Why did you let me go through the trouble of cooking? Um, I, 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 I didn't know she was coming. I know I'm going to put myself into trouble now. Look, th 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 this is not her father's office. It's, it's, it's my house, okay? okay. And she cannot... <laughs> Sandra, you honestly do not look well. Is everything okay? I'm okay, Miss Sandra. <laughs> I can bet everything is not okay. <laughs> what are... I hate you. I knew I should continue to avoid you. No, no, you don't have to say that. Listen. Listen. Oh, thank you. I ah. should take that. Yeah. Yeah. Thank Good. you. What are you looking at? Um, you're beautiful, and um, I like your maturity. Oh, what were you thinking? That I will get upset over some junior stuff in my father's company? Oh, no, 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 I wasn't thinking so. Yeah, my eyes they feel disappointed. I have a lot of respect for your kid. Yeah, she's a good girl. I know. That is the reason why I will not blink for this. You know, I'm beginning to like you more. I'll tell you what. I know you're dangerous, and I am going to do everything you and me possible within my capacity to stay the hell away from you. Cheers. Nobody wants my food. Oh, come on, don't be silly. You think I'm in for some fancy woman who prepared some fancy food? No, I'm in for the real deal. Your food. Yeah. Don't flatter me. Oh, 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 I wish I was. It would have made me comfortable. You see, my heart threatened and dumped ever since you walked into this house. Thanks. That's a good one. I didn't hear that. You're my guest. Okay. Now we go back to the dining room and believe me, we're gonna enjoy your food and anything else. Come on, take it. Let's go. Trust me. Hmm? Let's go. Follow me. Hey. I'm sorry I didn't tell you before coming. I really wanted to surprise you. Yeah, it's. I must say, it's really a surprise. <laughs> Indeed, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, let me get you food. No, no, don't bother yourself. I'm no rice person. Thank you. Yeah, I go with this delicious ever soup. Wow, bring it over here, baby. Good, 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 good. Ooh, ooh. Ah, oh my. Since I know you like a band soup now, I certainly will make you a very delicious soup. Mm. Do you cook? Uh, no, I actually have a very experienced chef whom I just direct on what to do. Any other thing you want to know? If there's anything else you want to know? No. Let's eat. Mmm. 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 This is delicious. What is it? You have to do something. Try to do something else. Don't do look at my face. Good darling. <laughs> Thank God, you all go that we have our peace and quietness back. You know what? Yeah. Just do me a favor. 
go back inside or take a walk. I want to be left alone, please. Lucky, okay. didn't say that, did you? Look, I'm really saving myself not to give you one hard punch right now. Okay, so please, please, I beg you, save your stupid face and your foul mouth, else I'll do so. Come on, man. You put yourself into this. How can you go after your receptionist and your boss's daughter at the same time? I was just coming to help. I mean, no, no, you weren't coming to help me. You didn't help me at all, okay? All you just did was play your stupid, silly pranks by making me a complete fool. That's what you did. Come on, guy, but you've never complained of my attitude before. Well, it's never been a problem to me or a threat till now. Okay, you told me a threat. Yes, what else are you? You know what? I hate you. Let Agreed, agreed, okay? I'm not a charmer, I'm not sweet with women, I'm not like you, but must you rub it all off in front of them? Okay, okay, let me apologize on that, alright? Right, I'm sorry. I just needed you to be more serious and a little jealous. I am not problem. jealous, you understand me? I am not. I hate you. I hate you, I, 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 I so much hate you, and I think it's about time we just split. Yes, we're no longer in school. Lucky you? Yes. Consider what I just told you right now. We should split. We're no longer in school. We are adults and have no reason to continue and live together. But if I were you, I would call both ladies and find out if they got home safely instead of sucking like a child. I did not ask for your opinion. You know I'm more experienced than you in this game, so stop playing hard man with me. Can you just leave me alone? Fine, sir. Thank you. Uh, look, I thought I told you to drop the sir thing. I'm more comfortable calling you sir. And besides, you're my boss. I'm, I'm sorry about, you know... There's no need for this, sir. You ordered me to come and make food for you, which, as a good staff, I did. Even if you turned my food down for something better, at least you can't say I turned you down. Am I disturbing you? I sleep early and I wake up early. Okay. Um, uh, goodbye then. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate it. Ten! <laughs> <laughs> so, how did it go, Pa? How did you want to go? The conversation. Look, can you just leave me alone? Ha 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 this game. <laughs> So you plan on going out and leaving me here alone, do you? I had plans to go out and stay out before you came. Besides, what happened to your cell phone? Why are you asking? Well, you should have called me to let me know that you were coming. That would have enabled me to plan my movement. So basically, you're saying that I'm not welcome in your house anymore? That's not the case. It's your house as well. You can stay as much as you want to. But I'm going out. And, uh, Don't wait around for me tonight. Because I won't come back.
Hello, best friend. <sighs> it's just been a disaster. What's the disaster? First of all, the date, and then now, Adewo has gone out and gone somewhere, and I'm sure he's sleeping there too. With another woman, I presume, eh? Well, I guess so. Oh my gosh, I'm so confused. Listen to me. You have to be strong, now. Okay? This is the moment you have to be strong. What do you think I should do? Good woman. You have to leave the house. You've got to tell him to go to hell by leaving that house right now. Yes! He's treating you that way because he knows each time he leaves you in the house, he comes back and still meets you crying your life out. If I go home, I'll be even more miserable. I'm gonna come to yours. Oh, baby. Oh, I really wish I was home to take care of you. I'm out on a date. <sighs> oh, um, okay. Well, I guess I have no choice then. I just have to go home. That's a good one, okay? That's the right thing to do right now. You just go home, take a hot bath and sleep. See, I don't want you to bother yourself about anything. Tomorrow morning, I'll come check on you. First and first, I'll call you, okay? I will. Just take care of yourself, okay? Um, okay. Good night. Good night. so long. You kept me waiting here in this garden for three good hours. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to do everything I could to get away from that back in the sun. She's called me. She did? Yeah. So she's going home. Mm. Mm. Now listen to me. If this relationship must continue, promise me you'll never keep me waiting. Sandra or no Sandra. I promise. I promise. <laughs> Prove it. Right now? Yeah, baby. Oh, look at this. I'm just gonna do it right away. <laughs> Okay. Well, good morning, sexy woman. <laughs> oh, my lord. I love you so <laughs> So, oh, oh. Oh, you perfume. Your perfume is magnificent. <laughs> yes. Oh, you need not be embarrassed. Now tell me, why did you sneak out of the room without telling me last night? Or this morning, rather. 
Give me that brother. It's you. I don't need me go out of the ask you. Be in my office right now to discuss business as usual. Business as usual. Hello. That, that wasn't true. You don't need to explain yourself to me. Believe me, I know my place here. Besides, my job is very important to me. Excuse me, sir. What? Haven't you forgotten something? What? Well, you usually tell me how beautiful I am every morning. Well, that was before you started this, your silly, sarcastic attitude I'm used to right now. You think say I'll be moving away for you, short, or get my foot? So, did you enjoy your weekend? Um, yes, I did, sir. Oh. And, uh, and was good company? Oh, yes, sir. Uh, I must say she's a very interesting and very intelligent lady as well, sir. Well, I'm glad to hear that. Yes, sir. Yes. Well, see, I would like the both of you to get along very well. It will help business, especially when I throw in the towel. <laughs> sir, I don't understand. I mean, I know we'll get along well, but you throwing in the towel. You don't think I'm going to work forever, do you? Of course I'm going to make way for you young ones to carry on. Ah, yes, okay. sweetie, I will just be there. I was just telling her, lucky here that I'm going to retire very soon and give you guys the opportunity to to carry on. Yeah, I'm sure you will seize the opportunity to to make me really proud. Of course, absolutely, Daddy. Or do you think otherwise, Mister Lucky? Of course, of course. Um, that's one challenge we should definitely uphold. And, sir, I have learned so much from you that I don't have any choice but to excel, sir. Uh, absolutely well spoken. I am proud of you. Oh, Daddy, you. please, I'm begging you now, don't start. You're making me jealous. Fine. When I speak like that, I actually mean the both of you. Hmm? Or do you have any reason why you think you cannot work together or even be together. I can't think of a reason why we can't be together, Daddy, unless of course Mr. Lucky here has a reason why we can't um, coexist. No, not at all, not at all. I mean, I believe we will make a perfect team. Uh, I am delighted to hear that. <laughs> we are now to business. You were here to see me on something? Oh, no, Daddy, I was actually looking for Lucky, Mr. Lucky. Can I see in your office? See, now I am the one to be jealous. You have suddenly come to take my boy away. Daddy, can you not say that again? I'm begging you now. I'm begging. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Is wrong with you? You know, I should be the one upset. Well, well, no, nothing is wrong with me. Tell me, are you by any means frightened by my presence? Perhaps because I am my father's daughter? Um, well, uh, sometimes. Oh, I... shut up, I'll be the man. <laughs> I don't remember send, sending for you. I'll come down, darling. I did send for her. Uh, Sandra, darling, would you mind excusing us? We are busy, as you can see. <laughs> oh. oh, hey, hey. Oh, shut the door. Okay, she's gone. Why did you do that? Well, because she's just a receptionist and I'm certain my father will not be pleased to find out that I saw her in your place. What are you now? Huh? Huh? Don't let now, would Hey! Thank you. How are you? Uh, I'm smiling. Where are you? <laughs> 
Hi. Good afternoon. I'll come and put this stuff away. I'm not your boss. I'm sorry, Cal. Good. That's my girl. So how are you doing? Um, well, it's been kind of dull until you walked in. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> <laughs> so what about your boss, Lucky? Yeah, he's in so I'm so sorry. <laughs> you gotta get used to me, honey. I will, believe me, I will. So, you don't mind telling your boss I'm here? Feel free to just go straight in. He definitely knows you're here and besides, I know you very well. Do you have a lunch date? Perhaps with Mr. Lucky? No, I don't. Well, which means we can have lunch together, right? <laughs> Maybe, if you ask me nicely. But it's my pleasure to ask you nicely. Well, with a beautiful lady, <laughs> have lunch with a poor admirer, please. <laughs> You're so romantic. Oh, <laughs> it's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. <laughs> <clears throat> Talk to you later. Can't wait. Thank you. <laughs> Let's just say I'm trying to be cautious. I don't want to walk in here and find you and your receptionist friend. You know, I'm compromising my man. I thought we were done with this talk. Not until I'm convinced that you truly mean to stay away from her. What do you want? Okay? I came to see your handsome face, not kiss me. <laughs> my oh my. Wow. Yes, come on, man. Office romance. Aren't you supposed to knock? Yeah, maybe my professor forgot that part of my education. Ah. How are you? Fine. Very well, and you? Oh, we are doing awesome, really fine. How are you doing? But I can see that. <laughs> I should excuse me, guys. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 wow. This piece is hot, but you've got to be careful before you get fried. I know what you want. Oh, he's on me, so man. He's on me. <laughs> well, actually, I, I went to see a, um, a house agent and he told me he has a very decent place, but you get back to me very soon. So, I mean, how, how's your day then? Look, we need to talk, okay? Um, how about over lunch? Yeah, I'm famished, actually. Even though I've not had anything to eat since morning. But, um, yeah, a lunch date would do. But, I do have a lunch date. Yeah. Look, it's alright. It's important we talk. You can come with your lunch date. Good. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> What? Like paying attention to me, please? I do that with my ears and not my eyes. I'm sorry about what I told you. I'm listening to you. Look, I, I, know, I know you're a natural prankster, yes. Uh, but it hurts me to also know that, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not like you. I'm not, I'm not smooth. I, I don't have your charisma and sex appeal that makes women get attracted to you. Which makes you so much uncomfortable, right? And he has turned into envy, outright jealousy. I, I don't understand. We don't have competition between us. No. I mean, what's this game is all about? Listen, I'm moving out. No, you're not. Says who? Me. I, I'm the one who always makes decisions between us. Oh. Yes. So you decided to throw me that, right? Look, I said I'm sorry. I said it's out of anger. Lucky, I know you very well. Tell me something. Are you confused about something? Is it something that you know that I can give you the confidence you need? Yeah, yeah, yes. I, I could do with your crazy, weird, whacked ideas right now. Okay, I just knew it. It doesn't matter. My manager will come for consultation fee. Please just stop. 
It's about Sandra and Anne. What is it? Oh, lunch date. You might have told you I was going to come with my lunch date. Hey, baby. You have this terrific, sexy walk that makes my heart to skip. <laughs> Thank you. Mwah. Please have a seat. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, yeah, good afternoon. Come on, man, stand up and give the lady a hug. Better still give her a peck. Don't just sit on your book like that. Good. Okay, sir. I should have asked you the same thing. I, d I don't get so. Yes. Do you enjoy your lunch break? I, um. Listen, sir. I do love you. I love you like a son. Anne is trying to get close to you because she knows it will make me happy. She knows I'll be happy if we can work together as one. I'm not, I'm not finished. Anne is very special to me. Anyone, and I mean anyone who hurts her, is stabbing me in the heart. And that will cause me pain. And when I feel pain, I react. When I react, son, I react aggressively. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. I didn't get where I am here today by being a whip. I got comfortable in this position because of my dream. The passion. The quest to succeed. Because I hate failure. You do have a weakness that I don't like. Um, sir, I, I do intend working on my weaknesses, sir. Now you do that. It's for your own good. I hope you understand that. Y yes, sir. Good. 